Hello Taurus, welcome to Brutally True Tarot and this reading is from 24th of May to 30th of May. So let's check what are the messages for you and uh, what you can expect in this week in love. Messages for Taurus. Three of Wands, Knight of Wands in reverse, Queen of Swords in reverse, Six of Pentacles in reverse, and uh, Ace of Cups. Okay. So here we have Queen of Swords in reverse. This Queen of Swords is in reverse because. Uh, she is quite upset about something. I think Doris, this is talking about you. This is talking about how they see you. Okay? This person feels like you have changed. You are totally opposite of who you are. This person can feel it clearly. They can see it clearly. They see that you are fed up and uh, you are done with what they are doing to you. Because I see this Knight of Wands. So, looks like this could be someone who has been flirting around. Who has been crossing the boundaries again and again. Who was probably not taking this relationship seriously. And I never had this feeling, Taurus, that you would um, react in this way. Maybe they can lose you. This person was uh, very sure that they are not going to lose you. You would be there but now this person is feeling that they can actually lose you in fact they have started losing you this person feels that there is something wrong and um, now they are regretting this knight of wands is in reverse so looks like you have made them realize what you were going through okay this person can feel this stress for the first time like being afraid of losing something they love being insecure this person is now um, getting to feel what you felt we also have three of wands so with this three of wands this person could be going through a lot it could be about anxiety it could be about stress it could be about depression so this is not easy for them also sometimes three of wands could talk about a long distance relationship so probably this person forgot their limits, but this person felt that maybe you're never going to know if they, you know, break their promises or if they cross the boundaries. It's not going to hurt you. And um, even if you know, you will probably forgive them. You won't care much. But now this person understands that you want the same kind of dedication that you are giving. This person now understands that for you, dedication and loyalty is everything everything uh, else can wait we also have six of pentacles in reverse so somehow this person feels like they are stuck they are stuck in their own situation there is nobody who understands them it feels as if everything has been taken away from you this person didn't actually realize how much they love you and uh, how much feelings they have for you this person didn't realize how you were making them feel special how you were making them feel better how much your love was uh, protecting them from the negativity now this person is realizing that without you they're alone here struggling with their issues struggling with their problems we also have ace of cups so uh, with this ace of cups this person is thinking about a journey okay they are thinking about what they can do to make situation better okay this person is actually now realizing that they seriously need to change that they seriously need to think about how they can get you how they can make things make things correct 
how they can make you love them once again. So with this Ace of Cups, this person is finally out of their comfort zone. And seems like they are ready to play their part to make their effort. And that is what I see here. This person is not feeling that they will have to show this courage to approach you once again. To work on themselves and to be a better person for you and for themselves. Okay. Of course, this is a general reading. This may not resonate with everyone. The energy could be reversed as well. Also, you can check your moon and rising time. So, let's go ahead and check some more messages for you, Taurus. Knight of Wands, Ace of Pentacles in reverse, Seven of Swords, Six of Wands in reverse, and uh, King of Swords in reverse. Okay. So we have Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords could be about something that they think is a barrier between you two. This person believes that now you're not ready to give them another chance. You are in this defensive mode. You want to protect yourself. You want to make sure that, you know, nothing ever harms you. You do not accept any kind of negativity. Now this person is realizing that. We also have this Knight of Wands. So this person somehow believes that they still got that magic. That will put you under spell. That will um, bring you closer to them. Although with this Ace of Pentacles in reverse, this person already feels that they have lost you. But losing you doesn't mean that they cannot find you once again. That is what this person is feeling like. They are looking at the positive picture. They feel like um, even if things are at the worst, you know, things can be handled. Like they can make situation better. So... In spite of feeling like you're not ready to listen to them, it's like you will say them a goodbye or you will, you know, maintain a distance no matter what. This person will approach you, okay? Because this King of Swords cannot wait. This King of Swords, you know, will get over the fact um, that they might be rejected, they might be ignored, or they might be told that they are not desired. But anyways, they are going to go ahead. Because waiting there and uh, watching for something to happen is not an option now. This person believes that if they wait and watch, they are going to lose you even more. And um, they don't want that to happen. This person is feeling like they need to be brave. They need to make a move. They need to approach you and they need to tell you how they feel. Also, we have six of wands in reverse. So, Taurus, this person is feeling that they lost at something. Like, they um, lost the most precious thing that they ever had, that universe offered to them. This person is not feeling that they need to prove you, that they are worthy of your love. They need to show you that, uh, you know, you can trust them. This person is feeling that they need to change something, okay, as quickly as possible. So, this person might approach you in this week. They would want you to listen to their story. Though they know that it's not going to be easy. But still, they would try. Because uh, if they don't approach you, if they don't say a word, the burden that they are carrying, the guilt, the fear, you know, it's going to be too much to handle. And uh, eventually, they will break down. They know it. So... They know that they don't have any other choice. They will have to be brave. They will have to take the initiative. They will have to see what comes next. Okay. So let's check an oracle message for you, Taurus. Sanat Kumara. Light activation. Shine your light. Your internal guidance is coming through loud and clear. So this card is telling you that you need to be yourself. Your light is enough to outshine everything that is in their life. And that is what is happening. Okay, right now. Taurus, you are that 
star that they need to find because uh, that is what that that is what um, that gives them the life they need at this point and um, you know your internal guidance says loud and clear you need to listen to that guidance and uh, you will be through this when it comes to dealing with this person so this was the reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye